technical differences between electric and petrol, basically we're running an electric motor, a controller and a battery pack. The combined weight of those things is usually more than a petrol engine. But at the moment, until we get battery packs optimised, batteries are the main weighty component. So we've got very heavy machines. The electric motors are capable of higher torque and higher power outputs than a petrol engine. But the problem we have at the moment is storing enough energy to make that happen. So motors are capable of it, but batteries aren't yet. At least to the, uh, the, the same sort of performance outputs of a petrol bike. But the key difference is, is that there's more torque from a, an electric motor than, the, than there is from a petrol motor. Virtually all the components are already produced. We've got chassis producers, suspension producers, wheel producers. They're already churning out things for petrol motorcycles. And we've already got motor manufacturers, controllers, battery manufacturers. All a manufacturer needs to do with a single motorcycle producer is put those together. Agni Motors are the pioneers of, of this type of motor. There's a lot of people coming into this um, environment now with new ideas, new designs, optimizing what's already been made. Agni have got something already in the foundation of all this and they're going to build on that and, and then develop new motors, new technology and they're going to make it bigger, better, faster and, and give us more.